Hey, ke hey, ke hey, ke hi everybody! I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you're all smiling and enjoying a lovely day. In this following tutorial, I'm going to be showing you on how to connect Vinyan to MultiV. That way you could be able to collab with other VTubers with transparent background. So let's go ahead and get started. What we're going to do is we're going to go into menu right here. Then settings. Then what we're going to do is we're going to go into graphics here. And then you're going to scroll down until you see the NDI sender. Um, basically, NDI is really good if you want to basically send, let's say, you know, this Vignon capture, for instance. You want to send it to another PC. Or for Multi-V, we could be able to utilize this as this will be able to send a transparent background. So let's go ahead and activate it right here, basically. Now, what we're going to do, if you don't know what Multi-V is, I will leave in the description below the link to Multi-V. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to have Multi-V open. It should look something like this. Uh, you'll have to log in with your Twitter account, so you do need a Twitter account in order to do this. Um, if you don't have a Twitter account, you can make one or, I don't know, but, or you can contact Iron Vertex about non-Twitter support? I don't know, but basically you can talk, you know, if you need any technical support, you could ask them. Uh, they do have a Discord server. But otherwise, though, uh, basically what you're going to do here is that um, you can share the invite link here to anyone else that is a friend of yours. Um, but basically here, you can... Um, I'm going to quickly uh, quit MultiV real quickly to show you. So here, you can basically um, click on New Room here. And of course, right here, there is Discord community. So you can join the Discord server and contact... Um, this person right here if you have questions or any technical issues so you click on new room here then what's gonna happen like I said there is the invite link there you can click on launch or download the app so if it's your first time um, download you know if it's your first time with MultiV download the app first and then you can launch it and then once it's launched then what's gonna happen is that uh, you should be able to have it where let's say um, I'm having some issues here um, but basically it should allow you so you can actually be able to connect with the room basically okay so I had to reinstall multi V for the thing to work but basically um, you should have settings like this here so over here this is where you'll be able to type in um, where it says NDI source you just type in Vinyan exactly like this now, as for MultiV, do keep in mind there will be some delays that will happen, uh, you know, because since NDI is a bit power consuming, it will have delays. So do note that um, you could try your best by, like, you know, increasing the uh, kilobytes uh, per second. You can increase it high and have settings like this, for instance, that could probably help out. I definitely recommend uh, something like these settings because it does like put less resources, you know, it, it puts less demand on your PC because you know it does use some resources, I think. Um, but basically, this is what I had to put in order to get like a sort of all right-ish delay. Like I still get delays, but at least it's not as bad. But experiment however you want, basically. But just note the delays are always going to happen. So all you have to do once you type in Vinyan and you make sure NDI is activated here, all you have to do is just click on Connect to NDI Source here, and then after some time later, um, you'll basically be able to have it where your character pops up here, basically. So give it one moment. Um, there you go. So there's Lucana. Oh my god. And I, like I said, there is that delay that happens, basically. Um, you can tell. But again, the benefit is that you can have uh, multiple VTubers here. You can share it with a transparent. And also, you can have the browser, uh, the OBS browser source URL. You can share with your friends. So that way, um, like either your friend will use it for themselves, or if they want to, of course, share it, you can share the link with other people, basically. Uh, but in a nutshell, that's basically how you can set up MultiV uh, and overall just get that transparent background support for Vinyan and making sure that it works perfectly fine. I hope that this tutorial helps you out and have a lovely day, everyone, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye! Thank you to all my Snowflake members. In case you don't know, I have YouTube membership, so if you want to further support this channel and what I do, then feel free to join the Snowflake members. Otherwise, though, just your support means so much to me, and I appreciate every ounce of it. Either way, though, with that being said, though, hey, 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 goodbye, bye, everyone. I hope to see you guys next time. Okay, bye, bye.